All right, so I'm loading up, going kayaking down the Co River. First time I've gone kayak down it, and it's like 20 minutes down the road from me. My used to be coworker Jason. I guess I call it, gotta call him a friend now. I don't know, but um, up to two weeks ago we worked together. But I, obviously now I've quit my job and left him behind. But we're still fishing buddies, so we're gonna go fishing. He's gonna kind of show me the way. All right, we're getting here, getting in the water. Last time I went kayaking with Jay didn't go so well. <laughs> Almost he tried to kill me. Uh, and I lost uh, a lot of stuff, my kayak flipped, but hopefully today's gonna go a little better. There we go. Number one. Come on. Come here. Can't get a hold of this thing. <laughs> Quit jumping. All right, we're going for some spotted bass, kind of one of the things that are in here, and there's some big ones in here. It's a good little start. Fun fish right there. Oh, there we go. Oh man, there's a big spot behind this one. There's another, there's a big spotted bass down there. Let me see if I can get this one off and throw it back in there. There's number two spotted bass right there. Where's that other one at? That one hit the water, hit it as soon as it hit the water. But yeah, they got the ladder tied off on a rope where they can lower it and get in and out, I guess. Oh, yeah! I think I hooked him in this. How did I hook this fish? Oh, yeah. Whoa, no, no, no! Check it out! Two spotted bass on one lure. <laughs> the first time this just happened to me a few days ago first time ever my that is awesome <laughs> I gotta get a picture I'm about to run this tree over here man no wonder they got all tangled up I was like what is going on I don't know how to get these things loose all right there's a little guy that was an awesome catch that's a good little spot of bass right there Oh, there he is. Oh, red breast. <laughs> I thought I had a big one. He really hammered that lure. What's those spotted bass I've seen would. That's right here. Yeah. There's been a lot of hard legs. Hey, this place is awesome. Look at this ledge right here in this cave. The water's real clear. It's little bass swimming around underneath me. Well, I thought I would be catching all kinds of fish here. But this place is just a cool little area to just to come paddle to and look at. Hey! Uh... <laughs> a little spotted bass is chasing around the fish I just caught. There's, there's three of them right there. I'm trying to see if another one will get hooked again. Finally got another one. Took a little while to get this guy. Gone through a bunch of water that looked really good, but I've seen a lot of fish. Most of them just wouldn't hit the lure. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Good fish. 
Good fish. No. Don't get me in there. No, no, no. He's gonna take me to lugs. Oh, there's another one with it. Hey, Jay, Jay, that thing was right on the bank. That's a large mouth, I think. Woo! Let me get out of this tree here. Oh, that's a large mouth. I think so, anyways. He is real fat. This guy was right up on the bank. Man, these things are so strong. He's not even barely over a pound, probably. Pulling in that current. I think he's a large mouth, but no tooth patch. Nice. They are right up in that brush. I'm like tossing up into it. Cast that I'm like, oh, they could get stuck on a log. That's my best chance to catch a fish. All right, let's go. He got up under my seat. Yeah, well, that's good. I got two bacon biscuits, so. I do want to try this thing, though. I got these little swim baits or Nikos. I'm thinking about putting one of those. I may have to put one of those on. That looks like that thing will... Yeah. I could probably put that on a four-pound line. It should hold up. Oh, yeah. You'd be fine. Oh, it worked. It worked. I just came through here and missed two or three fish. Came back through. I want to use the four-pound line on this one. With a little uh, Nico swim, swim bait. Caught a little spotted bass. Oh, come on. Yeah, there's a ton of them in there. Hit it, hit it. There he is. Oh, came out. Oh, there's a bigger one in there. Phone's going off, but I'm trying to catch fish. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. They're right underneath me. Hit it, hit it. Dude, this one's playing with it. He won't take it. It's gonna make me wreck. Open the cave. That's cool looking. There's one. Oh, that's a nice fish. Nice fish. Oh, nice. I got it on four pound line, so I don't want it to break me off. Come on. Right by the cave. No, 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 no. Yes. Nice fish. Oh, no. Man. I'm trying to make a break for it. Check that out, Jay. Yeah, buddy. It's a good spot. He was on the rocks. Probably 16 inches long. All right, man, it's such a cool place to fish. Around these rock ledges. Catch these nice bass like this. <laughs> Get back in there. Holy cow. Man, there's so big old spotted bass in here. Man, look at that dude. I mean, he's at least two pound, maybe bigger than that. It's crazy. Just can't get these guys to hit. There he is. Little one. Oh, there's a bigger one. Of course, comes up to check it out. Oh, sorry. There's definitely fish in here, even though they don't, you'll go stretches, it seems like there's nothing hitting. 
they're all over the place. These are fun though, these little tennis guys. And this has just been an awesome trip down here. All of a sudden, now we run into some cows. And we got turkey up here. Where'd they go? Yep, there they are. There's one right there. A couple right there. Over there eating. Cows came down to see what's going on. Got this awesome rock wall. It's been just a really, really great floating and fishing trip. Yeah, I do. Uh, Creek Fishing Adventures. <laughs> and we're back. Loaded up. Gonna take it back, kayak back to his truck upstream. Spent right at five hours from when we put in, I guess from when we put in to when we took out. Of course, stopped a couple times. Man, we saw all kinds of fish in there. A lot of nice spotted bass that couldn't get the hit. But still had a good time, still caught a lot of fish. Just the sites were worth going, uh, all the rock ledges and the cows and turkeys and everything we saw. Just definitely had a great time. Thanks for watching.